Hey guys, I'm James <laughs> Rambify and I'm this is Beth. Oh, okay. I'm Beth. Beth. Hi. And um, today we're interviewing those who seek. Uh, so if we just want to say who we are and stuff, what we play. Uh, I'm Matt and I play voice. <laughs> <laughs> I'm Brad and I play bass. Uh, Nathan, rhythm guitar and a bit of screaming. I'm Dan and I attempt to play drums. But I'm nice. Sean and I play alto saxophone in those who seek. <laughs> no, and guitar. Yeah. And guitar. And guitar. At the same time. I play saxophone, no, sir. I also play triangle. <laughs> Guys. I'm done. I can't do this anymore. I'm done. You play triangle, Hans. We're so, we're so, I know. So I, I can only. Talented. I can only sing and play guitar at the same time. Like triangle, just. I I'm play, done. I bet you play something awkward like seven eight as well. <laughs> okay, so moving seven, on. Seven eight triangle playing. <laughs> So um, yeah. how do you <laughs> how do you guys think the gig went tonight? It was cool. You happy with it? Yeah, for it me, fun. not so well because everything broke. That's <laughs> cool. It's Did you break? Uh, the bass. Well, I'm not because I'm using a double bass pedal. In the second song, the bolts came out of uh, the bar in between the double bass pedal. Oh my and god! So I didn't realize it. So it was kind of lagging behind. I was like, why am I playing, playing so bad? Today? And, uh, <laughs> and, uh, <laughs> and uh, then I looked down uh, about two songs later and I realized that. The bolt, yeah, the bolt would come out of the bass mm. band. I was like, oh, yeah. it's oh no. Bad you know I know it's your symbol broke, and I almost wanted to go up and be like, it's okay, I'll fix it. Yeah, I was, I was trying to get Matt to do it. I was like, you don't know. You know oh, what? Yeah, I didn't did realize. Yeah. Like, no, what was, anyway. what was really hard was the fact that Paul told us not to swear, and we have quite a lot of songs where we yeah. swear. So every single time I was about to swear, I had to go, so it looked like I was like stuttering or like choking yeah. or something. Yeah, I did the Deep same, although I just swore because I can, because I'm ace. You know what? The crowd seemed to have a. Bad ball. Greatly, so I think you guys played awesome. Thank so. you. Thank yeah, you. I thought you were great. Um, Sean always plays incredibly every single game. Yeah. Oh yeah, Sean's Le lead, lead guitarist. Need to, Come on, lead guitarist. Don't even need to turn turn the voice. Time. Time. Yeah. Outside the room, I sound check. It's a jazz gig. As I said, <laughs> playing like jazz <laughs> scales. <laughs> yeah. Beat <laughs> these guys. Okay, so um, why did you choose your band name? Those who seek, like, what kind of came about? Religious. Mass. Right. No, it's I'll, 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 it's right. biblical. None, 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 none of these guys understand it. <laughs> we understand I it. It's from the Bible. There's a passage in the Bible. Says, those who see it shall find. Basically, yeah. There's, 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 a, there's, there's a passage in the Bible, not because <laughs> we're Christian, just because it's like philosophical <laughs> and a way to live. So I don't know what philosophical means, but okay. I brought it to philosophy club. So it's basically just how to live your life. Is that in vain? And we think that's pretty cool. You should go out and get things. So that's really cool. I like that idea. Yeah, sick. That's cool. I was tempted to go out and get a Bible. <laughs> and then flick through it and then try and find our band name but then I was like well I don't have a bible so that just seems like a lot of effort <laughs> so I mean how do you guys write your songs now? Well, we, well, we, play, uh, we just start playing noise and then yeah, yeah, yeah. we, we sort of start organise noise yeah. Yeah. Um, do you know what I think you do I think you get a cauldron <laughs> and then you just put sugar in it and, and then, 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 then lyrics and then and guitars, guitars and then people and then yeah, well, the occasional people. ferret and you just stir it exactly together right. <laughs> no, no, stir no, it together and then damn it she knows the secret ingredient ferret I must find a new one one and a half ferrets as well the bum end not the head end normally you work to write a song where someone gets like a chord sequence and if you listen carefully you can see that chord sequence it's the same for the whole song and then we just change the rhythm and end it for make a chorus and different drums and then you listen to the song after that it's the same chord suit. Go like three songs and then, the same chord suit. Yeah. <laughs> what, so it's his input. He's like, I like this song. Got <laughs> on the microphone. Yeah. He just shouts his appreciation. So just change the key yeah. a little. Yeah. <laughs> 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 every song. Just play the notes on different That is exactly strings. what we, just, we like, said. Hey, hey, just do a break on it too. Slap you in the face with it. Really. Nice. That's yeah, fair no, enough. Then Sean makes it sound like we're playing something great because he's like, <laughs> I seriously think yeah. though, if that's how you write your songs with the cauldron thing, uh, your mascot should seriously be a ferret though. It's not, it's a, it's a pug. We're not into I'm getting we've, we've, got, we've got a pug. I like ferrets though. We've got Doug yeah, the pug. 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 That's pretty Doug cool. Doug McFly. Yes. <laughs> it literally Sick. is that. So um, how did you guys form them? Like when, where, how, what kind it's of wizardry went on? It started kind of as an acoustic thing in 2011. Me and Nathan were already in a band. This that guy. And <laughs> it wasn't really anything until kind of 2012, and we went for a few members. <laughs> right, and then in 2013, I was already doing something with him in summer, and then Ollie guitarist yeah. left. So hey, I was like, okay, what do I <laughs> <laughs> It's big holiday uh, side project. <laughs> yeah, we don't talk about that. Yeah. Um, anyway, yeah. Um, I asked Sean to be in the band, and then he was like, yeah, okay. Uh, I promised it would be awesome, and it is. So, oh, that's uh, and so then, cool. Brilliant. Dan was already in the band by that point, um, and then Brad joined in January 20, 2013. Yeah. <laughs> Take me on! So when we recorded the EP, uh, Brad wasn't here, it's I, the drummer, took him on. 
by myself to record the bass. <laughs> oh, no, that's, why, that's why the bass sounds so rude. Yeah. That's, yeah. yeah. <laughs> that's why when you come see us live, the bass is just so much better. Yeah. Yeah. That's awesome. Obviously. Obviously. His yeah. amp broke today because his bass was so good. Yeah. yeah. He was just like, he switched World's himself offended. off like, I can't handle this. No other explanation. <laughs> yeah. Seriously though, like, I have a point. The guy that discovered milk, discuss. The oh my god, what was he milk. doing? He was just sat there going, what? Milk! No. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> anyway! This white stuff comes out and you drink it. Guys. <laughs> that is Milk! Question no. Milk, everyone! Sponsor. Um. I, I the guy, <laughs> I the guy yeah, is so <laughs> confused. So, uh, where, where? where? How did he find milk? Like, he was just touching a cow's udder. <laughs> no! Yeah. Udder's yeah. such a funny word, we should have called the band udder. <laughs> That's very true. Okay, why did you guys first start practicing then? Like, what did you. <laughs> just go to that. Uh, milk. Milk. Let's practice. change. Uh, Milltown Studio, yeah, which is. John Baden said it's a We got oh banned from it. Why? What? I, I broke a symbol. We broke too. everything. Yeah, I snapped that. We, we broke too. everything. Essentially, we are essentially there, there was a. Um... <laughs> <laughs> silent, I'm joining in on this. It. This sounds like X Factor. No, Bikes on crew! Yes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, no, no. Essentially, we were inside the practice room, and um, the stand broke. So it wasn't like he was hitting it too hard. It was just mm. wear and tear. And because we broke, in the in the past, the person blamed us for uh, breaking okay. stuff. So we were just like, we're not going to tell him because he's going to make us overprice and pay pay yeah. for something. So uh, we didn't tell him, and then he contacted us and told us not to come back. So now we're cur- uh, currently practicing at EXR in Manchester. Which is a million times better. In certain ways. Yeah. Yeah. Not not looks weird. Nicer guys, nicer guys. That's cool. It's like how you should judge a person. It's like a run down and uh, it's like a classic, classic <laughs> place that bands start practicing at. Bit rustic. Yeah. yeah. In the in the past we've been in like a studio type place. Which was a bit high maintenance. Yeah. 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 That's a good vibe though. I feel more comfortable in like the run down place because it's yeah. like if you're in everyone's like a practice uh, recording <laughs> place, like, really really rehearsal too. studios, they feel uh, like you kind of put your can down of like Pepsi in there. Well, you anything. can't. You said you couldn't. You said you couldn't drink or eat in there. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Ooh, but then that this other place, a new place. Yeah, right. oh, right, it's yeah, like you yeah. let you eat, you let you yeah, drink. Yeah, just a bit more chill. Yeah. 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 That's everything. cool. That's what you want though. Like, I hate it when you're in like a really uptight environment yeah. or when you're practicing. It's just like, and especially if like everyone around you is like, oh, I'm great 16 in guitar. It's yeah. just like, 16. yeah, he's that good. Sure, that he's that good. good. He's, he's like, he's comment. like, yeah. Got, like Steve Viola. Five times. Yeah. I'm great 20 on I'm grade well, three. I'm grade oh, 20 and a half. I'm grade 20 plus one. <laughs> at, least like, you know, at least I can't play the triangle, so right? Over 9,000. <laughs> Over 9,000? If, if more people heard that, it would have been funny. <laughs> what, so, what did you say? Nathan, Brad, was like, Brad made a funny. He's going to mess it up now. He's going to start choking. Nathan was like, don't choke Nathan, go on. You were grade 0.1. That wasn't that. It was funny. No, it was funny when it at the time. Okay, next question. Do you know what's funny? Dan's wearing a yellow belt. I, I didn't even pink. kill the joke this can we time. Look at Dan, okay. Can we look at Dan's <laughs> okay. belt? Okay, okay guys. So, um, basically, where's be. been your best gig experience? Next to Amplify, of course. Uh, and if you can't... This was Club Academy. Oh, headline gig. Yeah, yeah, Club Academy yeah. Uh, in July. You played Manchester Academy? Yeah. Club Academy. That is so cool. We, we, we played, we played we Academy Which one? Well. One or two? Or? We played three and club. Club is like the like Club's like got a capacity of... Six, seven hundred or something. That's, ridiculous. that's awesome. Yeah, because it's, it's got the front and the back. Yeah. Shame thought it's supposed to have about a three hundred and fifty. I thought no, it was four fifty. It says on the definitely. website. We're forgetting that we didn't fill it. Yeah, it's but big. we filled <laughs> anyway, it. We filled anyway, it. Anyway, it's bigger than it's yeah, bigger than five hundred. That's cool. But yeah, there was there was about three or four hundred there, and like, um, we we got it filmed, um, and after watching it because we couldn't see anything, um, but yeah, yeah, there was there's some like nice pits and. Oh, that's really so cool. That's awesome. So that's pretty cool. Okay, now we're gonna oh, go on to hey, the, the, b- the Shut up! Right, I'm gonna go on to the just shut no, up. I wanna, I wanna speak. No, I wanna speak. Right. Not... What monster would you be? There we go. What well, monster? Fun what? questions. What monster do you want? Well, if you could be any monster, what would you be? Any monster. monster I mean. Any monster, just anything. Like it could Wolf. be from Pokemon, Who Yu-Gi-Oh. Would you be? Like, like something fictional. <laughs> Wait, no, because wolves aren't fictional, but I look like like, like Godzilla or like something like I'd that. I'd be Bradley. Okay. I'd be a sparkly yeah. vampire. <laughs> yeah, I'd, I'd be a sparkly word. vampire. Just so I can sleep with Kirsten Stewart. <laughs> <laughs> Kristen Stewart. Kristen Stewart. Kristen Stewart. Kristen Stewart. Kristen Stewart. Maybe she'd even like you know, maybe name. give hey, a wind and a smile. She might, she might just She'll go. Like, this is ah! the, I, would, ah! I personally would be a. Uh, yeah, that's not. You know the the werewolves in Twilight because they they can change the wolf whenever they want. And the hench. Yeah. Yeah. So you so you also get to bang Kristen Stewart. <laughs> yeah, but you know, yeah, but not, and then she. But it's like they can they can stay human. Right? 
Stop I would be Christian shops, Stewart. Nah. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> get your car keys. You get Do you to think so? Right, no? right, have you ever tried? Right, seriously though, this is another question that I've just come up with now. Right, right. Christian Stewart. Do you think she laughs without smiling? Like you know that. <laughs> 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 It's like, it's like a. Right, this is our band challenge, right? I want, right, we'll start this way and then, like, I want you to try and laugh, right? You have one time, try and laugh without smiling, like, proper laughing. Oh, no, I've seen them. What's that guy? Okay, go. No, proper laughing. Like, proper laughing. Like, deep laughs. He's crying. It's like a little cut. I don't even know that. That's just crying, It's like. <laughs> You're like, <laughs> well, I'm never gonna try to Go do this. Go for it. Just come, gonna on, come on. We'll do it together. We'll do it together. Okay. On three. Three, three two. two. Oh. <laughs> We're in harmony. Just yeah. beautiful. That's beautiful. Like a tractor. <laughs> okay, so um, over the course of your entire lives and Halloween and stuff, which happens once a year. Um, what is the best Halloween costume you've ever like dressed up as? I had a wizard one. Definitely this. <laughs> like honestly, I I don't. Yeah, rubbish. so definitely this. <laughs> no, yeah. definitely do this. No. It's not happened, but this year I'm getting a slender man like morph oh, suit, and I'm just gonna sick. stand in the corner of the room just going. <laughs> like, <laughs> you know what you should do? You should just put like the notes up saying no, 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 no. Yeah. Like, just put them up and then wait for people to find them and right, then follow you them. You should just go to a playground and put them up there and kids will be like, Mum, what's this? And then you're just going to start there Last year, That'd I went as an Arab and I had the full on Arab suit. Like, <laughs> that is so bad. Like, from <laughs> Dubai and everything. It's not even a costume. It's not even a We're not racist! <laughs> uh, last year, I went to Batman out of Kiss. So I, I had whiskers. That's cool. Oh, um. Chris Fairley? Can you just say? Peter Chris, that's it. Do you it. like yeah. when. Your armpit? Yeah. Oh, that was mostly a fun one. Nerf Is that PG? Mine's not, mine's perfect. Is that PG? What? Okay. So, um, what is the best Halloween costume you've ever had? So, um, what is your favourite scary movie? Keeping with the Halloween Let's go from this side to that side. Oh, I've watched too many. Mean Girls is pretty scary. Yeah. I don't know, go from that side. So, we got Mean Girls. That's pretty damn scary. I'm a, it's not really scary, but I'm, I'm a big fan of the Saw movies. I said oh, that. That's horrible. I, I, I just think, I, it's not like the scary, because you know what? Yeah, it's every happen, mindless you slasher. Aren't they? You're just there like, <laughs> that type of thing, and he's watching the hand like go into a saw and cut oh. up the arm. And this thing is really interesting. I'd have to say, fantastic Mr. Fox. <laughs> <laughs> God damn it. How can you even watch No, that? seriously, you know when like, have, have you watched it? Basically, yeah. there's a book, you know when you like zone out, the, the the possum things just like there, just with his eyes all circly. Mm. I freaked out then. Oh. Yeah. oh my god! It's just oh. Okay, what about you? <coughs> I don't know. Okay, that's good enough. Maybe you. Mama. Like that's the oh, most. Uh, that's the most recent <coughs> scary yeah, film I've seen. Bad ending. I don't think I've seen that. It's what pretty good. But poor uh, ending. Yeah. No, this yeah, isn't yeah, the scariest. Like if I watch it now, it would be pretty normal. But there's this movie called What Lies Beneath. Oh, I hate that film. That was horrible. I watched that when I was Ooh. eight. And like, do you know when she goes yeah, next eight. to the mirror and like when she's no, when she goes yeah. into the bath, yeah. when she looks in the bath, there's that woman screaming back. Oh, I couldn't have that. So I watched that when I was eight. Is it oh, actually, yeah. Yeah. What, what was that? What was that uh, yeah, TV maybe. show right. where yeah. there was like um, <laughs> it was every week and she could see ghosts and she got called. Oh, to loose women. No, it wasn't loose women. I watched that. He watches that religiously. I actually do. It's full of like political people. No, it isn't. It's all about. Okay. They talk about politics. Isn't nice. David Cameron's bum? That's politics. So. All right. So, our final think, question to no, you guys is: um, What are as a t as a team? You have to decide in like twenty seconds. Go team. Three words to describe amplify. Good. Yeah. Oh. Um, Luke, Average. No. Yeah. No, I'd, I'd say good. Uh, very team. friendly. Mm. That's three words different. already. Good, friendly, different. <laughs> Dif different, targeted, definitely. Targeted yeah. is one because it's uh, different it's for friendly. us. Yeah. Can we can we just say uh, in in a, in a sentence? So do you, yeah, do, you, do you think that. Amplify is yeah, great? Amplify amplify is I like great. Amplify. Why? Because come to Amplify. Because they told me That's to say good. this. <laughs> Sponsor. <laughs> <laughs> Please don't kill my kids. <laughs> <laughs> oh, will murder my family if I don't. Because my oh, kids are currently in the van heading towards the cliff. <laughs> awesome. Well, um, thanks so much for watching, yeah, guys. Nice. This has been uh, Those Who Seek, and uh, yeah, thank you so you much like for coming down. Thank you. Give them a like on Facebook and like Amplify. Support your little new kids.